Hello, beautiful brothers and sisters of the light, beautiful saints of the Lord Jesus Christ, beautiful world. I just wanted to send you all um, a quick message of peace right now, um, of joy right now, of just knowing that we have a supernatural heavenly father that is looking over us. He is watching over us. He is with us. The Holy Spirit dwells in us, okay? We have nothing to fear right now. Nothing. Nothing. Lord God, Father God, Lord Jesus Christ, I ask that each and every beautiful spirit that is watching this video, Father God, I ask that you give them peace of mind, Lord. Speak to their heart. Open their heart. Close the doors to all fear, anxiety, anger, panic, rage. Close those doors now, Father God, and just give them that inner peace that they need to endure in these times that we are in. Father God, we know you're with us and we will have no fear. In Jesus' mighty name we pray, amen. I just wanted to just hop on here really quick. I was just thinking there's so much, you know, fear that's being pushed out even by um, Christian uh, Christians right now. Um, just about, you know, getting your stuff ready, preparing, right? Um, preparing the boat, preparing your oils, um, the lamps um, with oil, right? Um, and, and, and that's all true. We, we need to do all these things, but because the enemy is pulling out all stops, he is trying his best to shake what can be shaken. But guess what? You and I, we have the Holy Ghost. We have the Prince of Peace. We have Yeshua. Oh, Lord Jesus Christ. We have the Almighty, one true living God, the Alpha, the Omega. We've got our Heavenly Father, Elohim, Lord Jesus Christ with us. We have nothing to fear. Listen. Right now, if you're having any kind of panic or worry um, about what's happening, you know, if, you're, if your job is pushing this um, shot, right? Um, if these things are being forced on your family right now, uh, maybe at your children's schools or um, the stores you, the local stores you 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 go to to shop lay your care at our savior's feet lay them down give your worries to lord jesus christ give your worries to our sweet savior jesus Cast all your worries and cares upon him right now. Do not look at the storm, okay? Do not look at the waves that are rocking the boat. What can be shaken will be shaken, but you are not going to be shaken. You have the peace of our Heavenly Father, Lord Jesus Christ. If you are feeling any kind of resistance or worry right now just cast them cast them at the feet of our father I'm serious you guys like he will protect us super naturally he is he is with us we have nothing to fear that is what the enemy is trying to do right now he is trying to pump out as much of that fear as possible. 
right now in these last days because he has to, he has to pull out all stops because his time is short. Listen, have no fear. No matter what it looks like on the outside, okay? Your bills aren't paid. You Maybe you've got fired or you're getting laid off because of you're resisting what they're pushing out. Hold fast till I come. Ha if you stand strong and stand firm on the word of God, okay? Get in this word right here. Start to eat it. Start to live it. It's living. This word is living. These are Jesus Christ's breath. It's his breath. breath of, it's the breath of life. We have no reason to worry. Yes, everything's changing. But guess what's about to happen? Our Savior's about to be here. Come on. You should be excited right now. Don't go out and get your guns and um, run for the hills. Yeah, if you can get in a safe place away from, you know, the ambulances and the fire trucks and the cop cars and the ghetto birds and, you know, all the things that are happening. If you can get away, you know, get away. But don't have, don't run in fear. Jesus is with us. He's testing the hearts. He's testing our hearts right now. The enemy's trying to shake and give men heart attacks. Their hearts will be failing themselves for fear. Okay? Don't have fear. God is with you. If you need peace right now, hear Listen to the words that are coming out of my mouth. Have no fear. Jesus, our Savior, is coming. He, His Holy Spirit dwells in us. Okay, and if you don't have the baptism of the Holy Spirit yet, I recommend that is something you're going to want right now. Okay, look into it, start praying for it. God gives good gifts to his children that desire it. Okay, start to pray because listen, when you start to, when you're getting in a way, right? When you're getting stressed by your, by, by what you see on the news or maybe by your family, by your children or your husband or your, your wife or your, or your um, landlord or your, or your boss, right? If somebody, or somebody driving on the street, um, that is full of hate that's trying to push that hate out on you listen That is the best time to get into worshiping Jesus, okay start to sing to him even if you don't feel it your spirit will start to change start to get in Start to speak in tongues, okay? When you start to praise the Lord and you start to speak your heavenly um, language, something happens up there. Something happens up there in the heavens. The Lord hears us and he comes back down and gives us the peace we need at that time. Sometimes it may not happen instantly, right? It does a lot of times, okay? But sometimes it may not happen instantly and it may happen maybe an hour later or 15 minutes later, okay? Or even the next day, but he will give you that peace you're looking for. Trust me, it is supernatural healing power of Jesus. He is drink from him. Drink from the cup of the Lord, not from the liquor store, not from the pharmacy, not from the food, okay? He is the Prince of Peace. Right now, He will give you the peace you are looking for. All you need to do is seek him while he still can be found get in the word 
listen to healing scriptures, listen to the Psalms with rain, um, take a moment away, turn off the fear-based television, okay? Don't drink the Kool-Aid of what they're trying to push out for us, okay? Don't take in that fear into your spirit. For God did not give us the spirit of fear, but of power and of love and of a sound mind. John 16.33 I have said, I have said these things to you, that in me you may have peace. In the world you will have tribulation. But take heart, I have overcome the world. Okay, he's overcome the world for us. He is where our peace lies. Trust me. Psalm 4, 8. In peace, I will both lie down and sleep for you alone. Oh Lord, make me dwell in safety. We will dwell in his safety right now. He is our safety. He is our peace. The Holy Ghost is our comforter. Psalm 72, 7. In his days, may the righteous flourish and peace abound. Tell the moon be no more. There's so many good scriptures. The Lord is so amazing. He is with us. He will speak to your spirit. All you have to do is seek him right now. Proverbs 12, 20. Deceit is in the heart of those who devise evil, but those who plan peace have joy pure joy the joy of the Lord Romans 5 1 therefore since we have been justified by faith we have peace with God through our Lord Jesus Christ our sweet Lord our sweet, peaceful comforter. He is our healing. He is our love. He is our peace. He is our joy. Drink from the cup of the Lord. He will give you the peace you're looking for. If you don't know Jesus Christ, and if you just stumbled across this video, he's trying to speak to you. If you have fear, anxiety, if you just don't know what to do right now turn to the Word of God trust these words God is calling you he will give you peace in these crazy times we're living in okay if you've already taken this shot okay don't have a fearful heart know the Lord is protecting you know that they say you know those who have the holy spirit they, sh they will drink poison and it will not harm them okay but listen don't continue on the path of following what the world is doing we are set apart we are not of this world we are of the heavens okay don't take part in what's going on out here close your eyes to the storm Close your eyes to the fear. Close your eyes to the hate and the anger and the rage that the enemy is trying to get your body, mind, spirit in. If he can get you in fear, he's got you, okay? Don't. Trust. We have a supernatural, almighty God that is with us. He is with us. Have no fear. If you don't have the Holy Spirit, I'm going to make a, a video um, shortly on, on 
speaking in tongues and ba the baptism of the Holy Spirit. And if you don't have it, you can watch that video. Um, there are other videos out there of other um, beautiful ministers and preachers and apostles that have, um, you don't have to have someone lay hands on you to get the baptism of the Holy Spirit. You can get it through just reading the word of God, through watching somebody that's anointed, through watching somebody that does have the Holy Spirit. You can get that if you do not have it, because if you don't, I suggest you start to desire it, start to seek it, because guess what? That gives you so much more peace of mind. Even if you have Jesus right now, you still need the Holy Spirit. You still need that baptism because it gives you, whew, it gives you power. It gives you supernatural healing power to fight right now in these crazy times we're living in. But let me just tell you something, if you're watching this, I pray you and your loved ones, ooh, Jesus, have everlasting, supernatural peace, supernatural healing. Lord, give them dreams and visions. Lord, let your Holy Ghost fire pour into their spirit and burn out all of the fear, burn out all of the anger, burn out all of the darkness that is not serving these beautiful souls. Father, I just ask that your presence be poured, that your spirit be poured upon each and every viewer right now and each and every person listening with their ears. Jesus is with you, he loves you seek him start to get closer to him get a closer relationship right now is the time he will be returning soon no we don't know the day or time but you also don't know if you're going to be here tomorrow or in an hour from now so seek him pray to him get closer to him right now i love you all in the mighty name of our sweet savior lord jesus christ of nazareth have a beautiful blessed day Love, peace, love is the way, amen.